figure uh in figure 5.5 a to d this a block moves to the moves to the right in the positive x direction through the displacement uh, while under the influence of a force with the same magnitude f which of the following is the correct order of the amount of work done by the force f from most positive to negative okay right so what they are trying to say here is there are four cases the first case is a the force is acting vertically upwards and the direction of motion is horizontally in the x direction so there's another case b the force is moving horizontally to the left side the displacement is horizontally towards the right side the third case c the force and the displacement they are in the same direction they are in the same, both parallel and in the same direction and in the last or the fourth case d f is acting at an angle with the horizontal and the direction of movement is x towards the right okay so they ask you to arrange these four figures according to the size of the force and according to the sorry according to the direction of the work done sorry according to the magnitude the size of the work done okay more precisely uh, you have to arrange these four figures the four situation according to the size of their work done okay so we're going to look at the first case the force is vertically upwards the displacement is horizontal so this is the case right w equals to the force times the delta x force is in the direction of delta x is zero it is zero so zero times delta x is zero because it's vertically up now in the second case the force is in the negative direction pointing towards the left the displacement is to the right so the f here is a negative f so we say that the work done is f times d but the f is a negative f then times the d is delta x in the third case the force is in the positive direction so it's fx positive fx in the last case uh, the force is acting at an angle the component of the force that is parallel to the displacement is f cos theta but this f cos theta is in the opposite direction so we write down there negative f cos theta multiply with the displacement delta x so by looking at the answers here 0 negative delta x positive delta x uh, f delta x and negative f cos theta delta x so we arrange this four according to from the most positive to the most negative these four cases which one is the most positive? A, B, C, and D. Which one is the most positive? Um, A? A is zero. Wait, no. C, C, C. Correct, C. C is the most positive. So, uh, if they ask us to arrange, we will type there the arrangement. Uh, uh, C is the first one. The most positive so which one is the second uh, 
Actually, we are ar arranging them in descending order. Descending so C, order. there will be next will be A. Correct A, because A is then mm, then D then B. Correct D because it has a a cost there, no? Because it has a cost there, so the amount is smaller. Then B, uh, there's no cost there, so it is the most negative. Sorry, B. Eh? So uh, this is the correct answer. So the correct answer will be this one. C A D B. Yeah, this one. This is the correct answer. The last one is the correct answer. Okay. So uh, now we know about this. Uh, the work done. Right. So we move on to 